What's going on everyone? This is ACAP24 from playbook.gg and today we're back with the gun flip trips mini scheme and we're looking at the third video of this scheme. Now if this is the first time checking out our channel and you want to win more games playing Madden, hit that subscribe button below. Don't forget to also click that bell icon to make sure you never miss any of our videos. Alright guys, so we're back. We're going to look at the play called PA Read. And what we're going to do is we're going to do some motion. We're going to take the outside player and motion them in. You've seen us do this motion in previous videos in order to keep this uh, mini scheme kind of looking very uh, similar. And what we're going to do here is we're going to put the RB on a streak. And then we're going to motion this guy in. Okay, so it's going to look like this. The route that I really want you to look at is this A route. It's a route that really does a great job of getting across the field and underneath cloud flats makes it really, really difficult for a user um, to cover. It's something that people kind of think it's a drag, but look how it gains elevation, and you're gonna get yourself eight to nine yards just by doing that. It's a play that's really annoying, something that, you know, from a uh, design standpoint, with that comeback route already over there, it's an outside released, um, you know, it's, a, it's not a, it's a stock comeback, it's not the one that you can audible to. It really does a good job of getting yourself some good yards over there. And what we're doing is we're basically making people have to cover both sides of the field. We go a lot of different things to um, the trip side, and now we're going to the solo side with this. Now, you don't need the running back um, on the play action to make this work. I'm going to take them off if you like the extra blocking. But you're going to see here that that A goes across the field, and you're going to see how easy of a cover uh, two or cover three cloud flat that is. They're going to go back towards that, um, that player there. Now, what I really like about this play is the ability to basically bait a user. If you've thrown that a couple times, people are going to say, you know what, I've got to cover that route myself. When they do that, that's really where this B route comes. It's a great against zone because it's got delay. Basically, it's going to be a corner post play, right? Because it's going to go break to the corner, go back to the post. And what ends up happening on that is it really gets in a nice um, spot that's underneath the zones because of the way we drive them off with the RB. The fact that it's a double move gives it a little bit of a delay. So if a user goes ahead and starts to cover that underneath, now what you're going to see is you're going to wait for this B to come across. Obviously, it takes a little bit longer. you got Khalil Mack as obviously somebody that you want to kind of uh, keep your eye on. But we're going to go ahead and step in the pocket a little bit, be a little bit more intentional about making sure that we get ourselves a little bit more time. But you're going to see the same thing here. I'm going to block my running back, and I'm actually going to slide right. This is going to give you a little bit better protection when it comes to uh, you know handling the rush. You're going to see that I'm going to go here, and you're going to see that that B is going to get underneath, and you're going to be able to throw that all day long. It's something that we are intentionally wanting to throw the underneath route. This, if you remember correctly, our first video, we showed you that uh, circle route or that C route by the running back that was kind of an annoying route that people had to cover. Then we showed you the route that we basically made uh, zones disappear with the cloud flat. Now this one's going to be one that's going to be a headache as well. Something we really like to go to on this as well is inside zone. It's kind of a two for one video. And if you guys know when it comes to bunch, they don't have a inside zone. It's the most popular gun run in the game. And because of the fact that it only has halfback base, halfback draw, this formation has the inside zone that goes with it if you move that guy in. So it's going to really help you with the running game as well. As you can see here, we're going to have that ability to kind of um, use that uh, type of motion to kind of get a compressed set. And once we get that compressed set, you're going to be able to kind of use that to your advantage where you can either bust it outside or keep it inside depending on the holes that you see. So the fact that we're able to use inside zone with that same exact type of motion is really going to help you with your pass game as well. Anytime you can show the same look and make people worry about pass uh, or run, especially with all the type of annoying routes that we're putting on the field on this three-day mini scheme, it's a really nice start and ability to use this in a positive way for you. Now, if you guys haven't uh, already known, we have done a bunch of stuff in Arizona Cardinals playbook this year for our playbook.gg. We hit up the um, the full playbook and the the uh, game plan that I wrote for the Cardinals offense. We actually did something with uh, KMAC with the gun spread. We've done a bunch of other formations when it comes to the gun wing stack. Uh, Zan did one and um, the single back wing tight that we, we talked about earlier uh, as far as last week. 
this is just another formation that you guys can add to that arsenal. If you guys are really interested in being able to uh, build off of an offense, we've got over 100 plays just in Cardinals alone. You're definitely going to want to check out our uh, website, www.playbook.gg. It's a subscription-based website for $9.95. You get all of those access to all those. Something great to study going into Madden 20. That way, not only do you finish the year Madden 19 strong, but be, building off those concepts that we showed in one playbook is really going to give you that leg on the competition when you start next year. We appreciate you guys, and we'll catch you on tomorrow's video. Now, if you like this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure you check out these videos below for the most helpful Madden tips. If you're looking to learn from the best players in the world, head over to www.playbook.gg for the most detailed game plans in Madden.